Okay, so for today's uh, demo, uh, we're going to be doing uh, this uh, Licato. Uh, it's, uh, it's a wireless uh, guitar transmitter. And it uh, comes with a, a dual charging cable. And there's two pieces. Uh, there is uh, the transmitter for the guitar, which shows the guitar on the back. And then there's another one uh, for the receiver here. Okay, and uh, it flashes when it's in standby. Uh, so if I'm going to pair it with uh, this uh, guitar here, I just uh, hold the button down for two seconds, and then they'll pair. If you want to change the channel, you just have to hold this button down, and it'll change the channel. And hold it for two seconds, and it shuts off. Connected. Okay, so I'm uh, turning the sound down so I don't get feedback or anything. Uh, this uh, does say that it uh, has issues with uh, battery operated guitars, so this is a battery operated piezoelectrics and it uh, does uh, have a bit of hiss as a result of it. So I normally don't get a hiss uh, when I'm just playing wired. Uh, I have noticed uh, when I do play it with the piezo. Uh, let me move over here. So I, when we, when I have it on the piezo, and like I said, this is a battery operated. So uh, here I'm gonna plug it in. So I just have to put it into the quarter inch uh, port here. Okay, so quarter inch port and pair it now I'm uh, not using uh, my standard uh, microphone because it has uh, uh, some uh, noise gates and you know uh, anti hiss and filtration so I'm just using the uh, uh, standard uh, microphone on the uh, phone here and uh, hopefully it will come through. I'm only giving this about a three out of five stars for performance. Um, you know it, it, it is a they're very nice. Uh, the charge lasts for about four and a half hours like they, they claim. Uh, so I, I've uh, run it for you know turning them on and off for three four days. Uh, when you turn it on, uh, there is a, uh, a battery indicator, and you'll see it uh, has uh, four gauges here. So uh, right now it's at about three quarters, which isn't bad. Uh, I charged it, uh, I think it was two days ago. Uh, the uh, receiver on the amplifier uh, tends to uh, must draw more power uh, so it, it ends up uh, you know uh, depleting a little bit quicker than the guitar actually does um, it does have a little bit of hiss I also have a, a U bass with a piezo and it also has some dropouts um, and it does it is nice because you can move around the house and not have to worry about uh, cables or anything but it does have its limitations it is uh, you know it's good for you know walking around the house getting a signal isn't a problem uh, but uh, there are you know a, a couple of dropouts and uh, hissing hissing is probably my biggest complaint um, and I also have it hooked up to a, a solid U base and that uh, it sounds pretty good but there's a bit of a delay and with it being UHF uh, it seems to be a little bit of some kind of a noise cancellation so all in all uh, like I say um, I wouldn't use it for a recording situation uh, but for kicking around and just uh, you know jamming around the house it's uh, it's great yeah uh, so a little bit of volume here.
Transmitter uh, it's a 70 series. Hmm. Thanks for watching.